what's up y'all and welcome back to the channel and we are arkansas bound we are currently in meridian mississippi had to pull into this love truck stop suck up a little go-go juice and get a drink for the road and we finna get <clears throat> back on the interstate but we headed to arkansas to head it back over there to hunt with jake and glenn from chasing green hopefully we'll have a better trip this time uh the weather is going to be so much better it's going to be clear and sunny um for the last two days we're gonna hunt we're gonna be there for three days this time uh the, tomorrow which will be our first day hunt um it's supposed to be actually it's supposed to like be a chance of sleet and snow and stuff tonight up until like four or five o'clock in the morning so but uh, it's gonna be kind of cloudy and overcast but it's gonna be cold you know last time it wasn't all that cold and it was rainy and nasty so it's gonna be a lot better this time at least the weather looks better anyway but yep I got off work today at 5 o'clock. I was working day shift. I went in at 5, got off at 5. So I've been up since about 3.30. And I'm going, I should arrive in Arkansas around between 12 and 12.30. So around midnight or shortly after. And uh, catch a little power nap and get ready to meet up with Jake and Glenn in the morning. So pretty much running on no sleep for the first day's hunt anyway. But that's all right. Hey, it's duck season. We got to get after them. So, uh, yeah, you can call this, I guess we can call this hashtag team no sleep, I guess. But, yep, we're going to get back on the interstate here and be headed back towards, or headed towards Arkansas. So, y'all come on, let's go to Arkansas. Well, we're getting there. We in Louisiana. It's been snowing on me for the last hour and a half. And for an Alabama boy, this is all new territory to me. I ain't used to driving in the snow. We made it. We here in Arkansas finally. It's like 115, 120. So we're gonna go in here to the room and uh, bring all our stuff inside and uh, maybe try to catch a little power nap and we're getting ready to go get after some ducks here shortly. Still snowing, so that's pretty cool for Alabama boy. I'm not used to that. So. Be my first time duck hunting in the snow. Well, we're just getting to the boat ramp. Finna get the decoys and gear loaded up in the boat, and it is still snowing like crazy. This is just absolutely insane. I never dealt with any hunting in the snow, so looking forward to this. But I think we finna put a hurting on the ducks today. That's just my prediction anyway. Hopefully we can get a big make big mix of mallards and gabwalls. Who knows what? We'll take whatever we can get. But check out the boat. The boat has got ice all over this bad boy. I mean, it is just loaded down. So I'm gonna get things packed up here, and uh, hopefully this the snow is supposed to slack off here in the next hour or so. And uh, next time you see me, hopefully we'll be setting up on some ducks. Huh? I did see him. <laughs> did that one out there go down? Yeah, he got it. Oh, did he? Good deal.
than that one. We've changed spots. We were set up out in front of us. <clears throat> we got four gab wall and a shoveler. The birds kind of seemed to want this side over here, so we packed everything up and moved across to this tree line over here. So hopefully, here shortly, things will look up for us and we can get some more birds in here. What's up, y'all? I'm back here at the hotel. We decided to call it a day. Uh, the birds just were not cooperating. You know, it snowed all night, snowed up until right at shooting time. It was extremely, extremely cloudy, and I don't know if the birds were seeing us, if they just didn't like the spread, if it was the mojos, I don't know. But we just, we tried all sorts of things, and they just did not want to cooperate. So, we decided to call it a day, we went and scouted a hole for in the morning, and it's it looks promising it looks like it's going to be a really good shoot in the morning so lord willing we got high hopes for in the morning but we finished the day with four gab wall and a shovel of drake not a bad day we got five ducks we got no complaints we went out there in the in the snow almost zero visibility on the lake it was rough choppy water wind was blowing like crazy but we had a good time we had a good hunt we didn't get skunked and we're thankful for that so got two more days up here with Jake and Glenn with Chase and Green so hopefully we can go chase some green get on some green some mallards maybe some more gap wall shoveler pintail widgeon whatever we take we saw a lot of pintail this morning we saw some widgeon this morning a lot of shovelers the gap wall a few mallards so you know the birds are here we just got to get on them so the hole we scouted today in the morning looks really good so we're hoping for a good hunt in the morning but that's all i got for you this week guys so until next time y'all bust them up